Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Breaking news. Inok Mwepu rushed to UTH after collapsing. Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Inok Mwepu rushed to UTH after collapsing. Zambian soccer star and former Brighton midfielder Inok Mwepu this morning experienced a suspected heart attack and fell off the car he was driving. The 24-year-old who was last October forced to retire from active soccer after being diagnosed with a hereditary heart condition was picked by a good Samaritan who rushed him to the hospital. Before the soccer star was seen falling off his car, the automobile was area swerving on Great North Road, an indication that the driver was in panic. A source close to the story said the incident happened when Mwepu was driving towards Kabangwe when he experienced the discomfort. Mwepu was driving along Great North Road near Kabangwe area. He was heading out of town. So it's like he started having obviously heart issues. When he started having cardiac arrest, he started driving zigzag. So the vehicle that was just driving behind him, when they saw Kutisayen Zamushe Uyumuntu, he's not driving safely. Then he eventually parked and came out of the vehicle and fell, the source said. A man who was driving behind Mwepu picked him up and started driving toward Mam's hospital. He started driving to the hospital, Mam's. So he called Mam's to say, I've got a patient, it's like he had a cardiac arrest and he needs attention. Mam's staffers advised to say, just take him to UTH because we don't have capacity. But he said no, that's the nearest hospital, I'm bringing him there, the informer said. He was quickly seen by a doctor at Mam's hospital who stabilized him. It was discovered that he suffered a shock from his peacemaker, a device used to control an irregular heart rhythm. It has flexible insulated wires placed in one chambers of the heart. So what came out is that he's got a peacemaker that I think was put in the heart which helps him. Now it seems probably it developed a fault or it started misbehaving. So it's like it started giving him electric shocks to the heart. The doctor said it's not really a cardiac arrest but it's like more of fear because of the electric shock, the source said. As of now, they have taken him to UTH. They have taken him to the heart hospital at UTH. Ratsa and police quickly moved in and escorted the patient to the hospital, UTH. Last October, Mwepu was forced to retire at the age of 24 as he has been diagnosed with a hereditary heart condition. The Brighton and Zambia midfielder announced on as he hasn't played for the Seagulls since September. But the statement released by the Premier League club, Mwepu fell ill on a flight to Mali last September as he was away on international duty with Zambia. Subsequent tests discovered a hereditary heart condition which compelled Mwepu to retire from the game. Brighton confirmed the condition which can worsen over time would put Mwepu at an extremely high risk of suffering a potentially fatal cardiac event if he were to continue playing competitive football. Part of the statement read, nicknamed the computer for his superb positional sense in midfield. Mwepu signed for Brighton from RB Sosbeg in the summer of 2021. He has made 27 appearances for the Seagulls, scoring three goals, one of which was a memorable strike at Anfield against Liverpool in October 2021. I'm so sorry this happened to you, my brother. Get well soon, Inokimwepo. God is with you. 
more news to come my lovely viewers make sure you subscribe to this channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and also turn on the bell icon to join the notification squad for now i'm out All right, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutati Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.